both of these sides went into this game with new men at the helm. Zebre with Italian Andrea Cabanato as head coach, looking to secure that elusive first Pro 12 win, having come close without too much reward last season. This was also Pat Lamb's first competitive game in charge of Connacht, hoping to improve on the Irish province's eighth place finish last season. The Westerners welcomed Fionn Carr back to the sports ground, having spent a couple of years at Leinster. And Lamb's men were swiftly out of the blocks. Nathan White got over for a try in the fourth minute after a catastrophic quick line-out move by the Italians. Good awareness from White and a dream start for Connacht, despite Darren Park's missed conversion. The visitors stayed in touch, however, straight from the restart with a Luciano Orquera penalty for five points to three. <laughs> then a significant breakthrough in the 29th minute for the home side. Connacht spread the ball swiftly from one side of the pitch to the other, and with the Zebra rear guard stretched, winger Matt Healy burst over for Connacht's second try of the match. A first Pro 12 try for the Dubliner. And when Parks converted from near the touchline, suddenly there was a little daylight between the sides at 12 points to three. The Scottish out half landed a further penalty before half time to leave Connacht 15 3 ahead at the break. Orquera was keeping Zebre in touch with his boot. Two penalties into the second half brought the score back to 15 9 on the hour mark was still all to play for. From the restart, Zebre's lack of discipline was punished by referee Rhys Thomas. And Parks was presented with the chance from another penalty, which he duly put over to make it 18 points to 9. Then six minutes from time, with Zebre sub Mario Praticetti sent to the sin bin, it was time for the prodigal Fionn to get over for a try that sent the home crowd into rapture, combining well with Paul O'Donoghue to race clear and consolidate victory for Connacht. Parks converted, and the points were absolutely safe. Substitute hooker Andrea Manici got over for a late, late consolation try for Zebre, but it was too late to affect the result. Orquera converted, but it's Connacht who make a winning start, and Zebre still look for that first ever Pro 12 win. Final score at the sports ground, Connacht 25, Zebre 16.